Hi guys, welcome back to my latest video. Um, just want to show you what's on the screen here. This is the final ranking list for a season that I did. Um, it is probably my 30th season or something like that. Um, I've managed to win 10 ranking tournaments, which is about 5% of what I've played, which is quite good on 9-ball, good luck. Uh, Steve very kindly posted that he thought that this was virtually impossible. Um, I do know that Albanorio did it, and he actually did it with 80 ranking points more than me. Uh, 480 which is pretty pretty good <laughs> pretty well, very good um so i just want to show you that guys it's the first time i've ever done it probably the only time i'll ever do it absolutely delighted i've now achieved virtually everything on the on the offline game i've won the two rankings i've won the masters i've won the world championships twice i think um and i've won the first ranking event of the season so uh nine ball good luck has been conquered which is awesome um but today i'm going back into the ranking list so we're going to take this off i do apologize if this comes off a little bit wrong and this should work hopefully and oh, hang on is that i just need to eliminate that and then we can go into this and start our game so that that looks all right i've already positioned my camera um, and look who i'm playing i'm playing with myself in a pooling sense uh, so if i lose to myself technically i've won so you know all good but anyway um, I've already crashed out the opening ranking event and the world's they must have punished me because I played Mr. 400 and then the Dazzler or perhaps the other way around that was um, so I crashed out of that pretty pretty impressively uh, Hadi, you've got to, to win the, the career mode it is very difficult you've got to have good draws you can't rock into Louis or Mr. 400 or the Maraja or Mad Max, even tall Stephen Curley can prove very difficult. Um, it's quite accurate, it's more like me than, than I am. Uh, if you get a good draw, you can get to a point in this game where you can confidently beat most low-level AIs, but the high ones, you know, occasionally, Crown City Corey is another one you can just get turned over. Uh, but yes, yeah, so I'm delighted to have conquered that. Um, I'm not quite sure what my next challenge is, in terms of this game, uh, I think snooker and eight ball etc are not that difficult to beat. The nine ball is certainly very hard. Uh, I've tried shooters pool, and you know I'm not dissing it here, but I do find that I'm a VP4 junkie, unfortunately. Uh, I want to give a big shout out to Ash. It's my girlfriend, and just when I say that, I go in off. Fabulous. Um, She's actually very attractive, so God knows what she's doing with me. Okay. But yes, it's been a while since I've played proper pool. I remember that photo in the corner there just being taken. Um, it was in the local pool hall. Ooh, what, what, have, what have I done here? Nothing. Got lucky. A few years ago, that picture now. Ah, uh, it's more like it. Right, so here I'm going to screw into the nine ball. I don't expect to get it, but I might be able to open something up. Got lucky there, uh, but I might have a chance. The run out, I'm not thinking run out at this point. Well, to be honest, I am, because I, I find it hard to not plan for a run out in nine ball, but I need to land in between the five and the, and the eight, so it's all dependent on the angle I get here. So I can play this with top left, Probably just top. I don't want to go past the eight. That looks pretty good. But being on top of the eight's not great. Uh, here I just would like to come back into the eight ball. And that's worked out pretty well. That's kind of solid. So in this uh, career mode, I'm not expecting to do much. My kind of default position that you guys have seen me do many, many times is where I finish like 13th. That seems to be my sort of default place where everything else goes sort of as it normally does. Um, again, I'm kind of struggling with what to do now. <laughs> it's a massive... I think this is the point where I'd start to lobby Steve to create Virtual Pool 5, really. Wouldn't that be the worst clickbait title? Virtual Pool 5 announced, and then just put one of these up. 
you guys would dislike it very and you deserve it I deserve it <sighs> fancy that nine there fancy the double as well which I got but I fancy the nine so here we need top left because we need to spring off that cushion and I don't know if I've gone far enough oh got lucky now we do have the nine here if we're really in bother I'd hate to miss this ball I think I've got it where's the white oh I never thought about that ah just when I put side there just in the last second I thought what's going on oh that's more like me than I honestly that's a really accurate description of my game right here we're just going to play it with a little bit of bottom because if we miss the black we'll probably get the nine there you go easy peasy um, now here there's not a great deal going on probably use the three in the the green as a buffer I over hit it, it's not the worst thing in the world because I was probably not going to leave a pot um, what I am thinking about doing guys is I've had a, a poker overlay made which is very swanky um, and I paid decent money for it I thought I would stream a little bit of poker on Twitch something to do I've also set a goal to do f uh, to stream flight simulator but I've one slight down drawback to that is I'm not really sure how to fly so let's sort of stop that uh, the only other thing to update you on which I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to look at that black ball happily spinning I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to keep to but I am now attempting um, a low carb diet now I am the carb monster all the weight you see on me is it oh that's a great shot oh I enjoyed that one um, all the weight you see on me is a result of carbs. I love carbs. I love gold. I'm like carb member. If gold member loves gold, I love carbs. Um, which is why I called myself Diet Carb on Twitch for a while. Didn't really catch on. Everyone kind of didn't get why I was called Diet Carb. They thought I meant... Well, it was really because I love Diet Coke, so I'm not quitting that. Because I just can't. Um, that's no good. And I knew it straight away. No, it's not. But uh, what would you do here, guys? What would you do? I think probably try and go behind the brown. Snuggle up behind the brown. Like so. And that'll do. Um, so, yeah, I was... Uh, oh, spiky here. Um, giving myself a good beating. It feels good. Uh, so... So yeah, what I'm eating um, is like what I had tonight is a uh, uh, no potatoes, but I had mushy peas, which are kind of kind of good because you need something like gooey that kind of binds things together, otherwise it's quite dry. So that allows me not to have gravy. I have a piece of uh, chicken breast, generous chicken breast, and some vegetables, which are usually carrots, broccoli, and cauliflower. Um, now my breakfast is planned to be. Uh, eggs and some mushrooms mainly scrambled eggs and my lunch could be a wholemeal roll with turkey lettuce tomato no mayonnaise and that's kind of a oh man how did I miss that that's kind of a a, a slimming world kind of extra now, actually, in Slimming World, you're allowed more sins than that, and you're also allowed unlimited potatoes. So I thought, well, if I can cope with this, given that I'm over 300 pounds in weight, uh, then I'll probably lose weight very quickly. And it's actually a diet that I think I should be able to do. So I'm going to give it a whirl. So if you guys see me skinnier, that's probably why. I'm going to, you know, fingers crossed I, I can keep to it. Um, the idea is also exercise. If I've gone enough here, I'll really be unhappy. That was the problem there, it was too straight. Um, so the whole point is here, guys, is to be more healthier. I'm not so worried about my weight, just in terms of I want to be healthier, I want to be fitter, um, more energetic. Because I have got some health problems, um, which I don't want to get any worse, so I want to slow them down, getting any worse. Now here I want to move this four ball, guys, just to hit it. And I have, but I've made it worse. 
that was to make my life easier. Although the five is close by, so you don't need to worry too much. It would have just been slightly easier than having it stuck to the cushion, because that's usually where my game goes a little bit pear-shaped, really. And what I've decided to do, if I can start wearing my contact is, you can go to this like training thing um, and to get back into Q Sports, but Oh, I thought I missed that one there. But I'm playing well here, considering I'm not really concentrating on what's going on. Here I'm going to cheat the pocket and go fast down the table. Get past the nine. That's perfect. So I am playing quite well here. Um, if you can get your rating above 2200 against the AI, which is not easy, but it's doable, you find that you start getting... I find that you start getting easy wins off some of the... Computer opponents, that's a great break. Now here you expect to clear up. I'm going to show you my stats at the end of the game because I'm pretty proud of them. I've now had over 2,000 break and clearances. Um, and over two, I think it's, ah, oh, messed up the clearance, idiot lunatic. Oh, and I've stuck it up as well. There's nothing worse than that. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to do a bit of exercise biking when I get up in the morning. Uh, before I go in the shower, I swear this computer guys it is just like me. You know, here we're going to play the double. I expect to get it with a bit of top right to pop out for the eight, and I've got the nine, and that was just luck. So sorry to me. He's probably feeling pretty bad. I've been on I've been on the receiving end of a few of these in the past, where you just can't do anything right, and the other guy just seems to turn into the pool equivalent of Arnie. If I've left a path to that, it's really careless. I have. Now, even the fact that he hit it and did nothing, it doesn't take away from the fact that I shouldn't have left it on. That could be enough. Oof, no. I was careless, though. Very lucky that there is a path to, to righteousness, and I've messed that up as well. Maybe got lucky again. Wow, this is like really is like playing me. That was a better shot. Sometimes you've just got to leave yourself on, but not not necessarily perfect. This is an example of, of messing it up. If it hits a cushion, I might get... Sl is there an edge? No, there isn't, so I can just go for the jump. I'm quite in favour of there being a, a mode where the jump isn't on the game. That's obviously gone wrong. So I'll give myself a chance to get one rack back, or another rack. It's not a bad shot, but it's made difficult. It could go in off the nine here but it's a good pot and the fact that that spins going that way it'll just flick off the nine and it'll leave it on so oh in a disaster I'll get another one I've never actually lost to my version of the computer in this game and I did have the the fortune once of my guy going right deep into the um, into the games tournaments and that captured me in the final or near the final and that was some cool ranking points and that was a very good shot uh, you can afford to take those on when you're eight two up uh, now here does that pass it does so i don't need to do anything i always think your motto for pool needs to be no heroics uh, that's always oh and i'm too straight and that is quite so a bit aside try to kick this in just to skid the white across a little bit and that's the something on this game that VP4 does exceptionally well, those kind of skid shots. So hard to program that in. I don't know how he does it. In a way, I don't want to know, because this is just like the same as pool, you know. Um, but anyway, all that aside, and I missed the nine. That is quite insane. Wow. And that was purely me just waxing lyrical about how wonderful the game is. And I took my eye off the ball. Literally. What the hell was that? Um, probably about as good as that shot, really. I don't know what I was trying there. Thank God it didn't go in. And that is a good shot. Now here, there's no point in going for the jump. Because if you get it, then you really haven't gained anything because the four's so busted up. 
which is why neither of us are taking these shots on. So all you're really trying to do here is to hit it. Oh, what the... I tell you what, my eyes are going. I thought I could get through there, and I've just stuck it up. So here, you play it with top spin, you do try and move it, and the computer's doing a good job. Now it's all about mopping it up. I might choose to go into this. And not too bad. So there's a bit of a comeback happening here. Still very comfortable at the moment. I'm not panicking in any way. May well start if that's a poor push, is it? Or is it? No, I think it is because I can very easily jump over that and I'm coming back towards the blue. Um, now that's harsh where the, th the four's been hit because that's exactly the type of shot that I'm not very confident at getting. So here I need to aim for that hole without going in off. And we'll just forget all about that one. And that is insane. Why my version of the computer has done that. It's complete suicide. Um, you, you take all gifts that are donated. My, you know, very much like Tesco's, every little does help. Um, but it just proves that against these, you know, or even on nine ball good luck, there are some opponents. Unfortunately, my character is one of them, where you can, you know, playing relatively solidly will will win the day. But I hope you're all well, guys. I should have really said that at the start. Um, please feel free to comment. Um, tell me what you're up to and what videos you would like from me, because I do still do a few of them. I've had a, I've had a quiet week this week in terms of my other channel. Um, but I want to. I need to build that up, really. Uh, that was unlucky. So what do I do here now? I could go into the. What I'm going to try and do here is skid into the six with extreme side. I know I hit it, but and I actually opened it up, which was very lucky. I'll just repeat that and just go to where it is. You see, I do get a slight hit on it. Very, you know, if we go behind here and just have another look, as you can see. Before this shot, it's covered. I get the slightest of nicks, and I get a bit lucky with that. Now, the problem I've got is, well, that's a problem I've got, but I can still jump it. The eight's gone funny, and the six is funny as well. But this is now a runout opportunity, and these are the types of runouts, if I'm honest, where when I'm online, I hurt people by getting these. So here, all I'm gonna do, you know, it's gone wrong. I'm just gonna play safe and try and get behind the eight. Put a little bit more side spin so I can get behind the eight. Um, that's not really great, but it's sort of safe, but not really. It's the area of the table I wanted to be in, but I wanted that. It's always an error, to be honest, when you leave the nine quite close to the, the object ball, because then you, you know, you're massively increasing the opportunities they've got for a combination. Now, I want this to go past the seven. I haven't got it, but what I do have is a probable combination. And I've gone straight off the table. So I've kind of struggled over the line. Well, I'm not, I'm not over the line, but uh, I'm relying on some gifts from me <laughs> to me. Oh, I went for that get in there. I didn't think I'd get it, so I didn't really, you know. You kind of go for them, you hope, more than anything else. And that's a good shot. Those are the types of clearances that you need, really, 9-4. Just a couple of those shots in it. If you get those in a real match, it really does demoralise your opponent. So, I, you know, I should win this now. Always happy to win any match. I had to win a lot of them to get through uh, the, the career mode. I should have kept a journal, really, of what I'd played. That's not a good shot. But it's hard to. Not what's good, decent. Now here we're just. And again, we're going to afford to try these because we're ten four up. It means the computer's got to win seven nil, and it's never going to happen, unfortunately, against. Uh, against me at this level, probably. Because I know how good my guy is. When um, when I, when the Steve programmed the game, I, I sort of asked him to program it in that I could be good and, and could be bad because it was kind of the same I think he put me in slightly worse than what I am in real life when I practice 
it's probably it's probably optimistic compared to what I am now. Uh, but obviously on VP4, if you're putting in the VP4 strength, I just would like to say that I might be slightly better than this. Um, a little bit of side spin just to kick it over, and the game's over. 11-4. There we go. So I win the day through there. And I move on to play Quickie 9, who took out Mr. 400. And unfortunately, my computer guy gets Mr. 400 in the next round, so goodbye, my person. Career on hold and stats. Just want to show you those very, very quickly. Uh, as you can see, I'm down as a pro rank, which I think is pretty pretty not accurate. Um, the stat I'm very proud of is this run outs from the break of 2011. I think that's pretty good. Uh, but as you can see, I only make a ball pretty much 55% of the time. So um, that means that 40% of the time we have pot a ball, I'm oh, sorry, 40% uh, of the time I'm clearing up because I only put the ball, you know, half the time roughly. So that's a good stat considering I'm only really able to carry on half the time. And that's a long term stat because I've played nearly 20,000 games. Um, so the rest of the stats are pretty cool. Ball making average I have had as high as 7.98 in the past. Um, maybe even just over the 0 0.8, but that's really hard to do because. You know, it's just so tough to do. Um, Tournament's 110, which I'm happy about, and that's hard to do. Um, break foul 6.1, which is way too much. If you factor in, if you took out, that should be down to sort of 2%, I think. But in this game, you just can't seem to avoid the enoughs for some reason. Um, I'm not sure if it's programmed in, but or whether it's just user error. Um, but sort of 10,000 of those breaks, 6% uh, of 10,000. 1% is 100, so like 600 of those breaks. Is that right? 600? Yeah, 600 of those breaks have gone in off, which is pretty horrendous. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that, and uh, I wish that 1.6 million was, was real. Um, but it's over 20 years, so maybe I haven't done that well. Anyway, have a great day. Uh, get subscribed if you haven't already, and I hope you enjoyed the pool, and I will be back with some eight ball, with some straight pool, and with some snooker very soon. So have a great day, guys. Enjoy your week, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.